So in this question, they're talking about the hemisphere. And they've given us the formula for finding the volume of the sphere. So the volume of this hemisphere equals to 230 centimeters cubed. So the volume, the formula for the volume of a hemisphere equals to 4 over 3 pi r cubed over 2. Because a hemisphere is half of a sphere. So now we're going to substitute 230 into the formula. So that's 230 equals to 4 over 3 pi r cubed. And since we're finding the r, we're going to shift 2 to the other side, which gives us 460 equal to 4 over 3 pi r cubed. Now we're going to bring 4 over 3 pi to the other side. So that's 460 over 4 over 3 pi equals to r cubed. Since we want to find r, we're going to cube root 460 over 4 over 3 pi. Now you can just plug those values into your calculator and you should get a value of 4.788 which I'm going to round to 4.79 so our radius is 4.7 so our radius is 4.79 so for this question I'm going to separate the cylinder out by drawing it and so that we know the radius of the cylinder is 1.6 because it's given in the question. And since we're finding the height, so this length, we'll name it as h. And because they said the total volume is 300, we know that the volume of the hemisphere is 230, so we're going to minus that from 300 which would give us 70 centimeter cube so the volume of the cylinder is 70 centimeter cube so the volume of a cylinder equals to pi r square times h so that's 70 equals to pi or uh, uh, r is 1.6 so 1.6 square times h and since we're finding h we're gonna bring 70 over pi 1.6 square pi and you put that into your calculator and you'll get a value of So you're going to get a value of 8.70. So your height is 8.70 centimeter. So for the last question, I'm going to draw the two shapes. So this is the origin shape. And this is 
the mathematically similar shape, which I'm going to draw larger. Okay, so the volume for this shape is 300 centimeter cube. And the volume for this is 19,200 centimeter cube. And which is given in the question. So we know that the radius for this cylinder is 1.6. And this cylinder is, let's call it X. No, we can call it R. So this is R centimeter. So now we have all these information. So we can write it as. 1.6 centimeter over 300 centimeter cube equals to r centimeter over 19,200 centimeter cube. Okay, so we know that to get this and to get this, we would multiply x. And for this, we would multiply x cubed because we're finding the volume. That's the, that's the rule when you want to multiply a volume. And if it was area, you would do x squared. So x cubed equals to so three hundred times x cubed equals to nineteen thousand two hundred. So x cubed equals to nineteen thousand two hundred over three hundred. And so because we want to find x to calculate r, x would be the cube root of nineteen two. 19,200 over 300. So now we can just times 1.6 times x, which would give us r. And since we already found our value for x, we can just sub that into the equation. So the cube root of 19,200 over 300 equals to let me just put that into my calculator so I got the value of 6.4 centimeters so our radius is 6.4